Hello people, this is Connie from Camp Decorations Spray Shields. Are they worth having? Yes they are. Now, I've got three sets of spray shields that I use. I've got um, these new ones which I've been using, which are disposable ones made by Trimco. Uh, which I just made out of cardboard. There's the thing that you just push it on. Nice and easy, I think they're about 70 pence each. You just push it on there. Can't use these too much because they're not accurate. As you can see, it's got a bit of a curve in it. But what I've noticed when using these, if you use one side, let it dry, and then when you go to use it again, use the other side, let that dry, it sort of straightens out and forms its shape. But as I say, I mean, these are disposable ones. So for instance, if I was doing my own work, uh, price, price up my own jobs, I'd buy these, use them once, and maybe keep them, and use them again as quick disposable ones and throw them away. Now, for instance, I'm gonna go around and spray the reveals in this, in this plot here. Whoever miscoated this plot hasn't actually sprayed the reveal, so it needs two coats. Now, what I usually do is I go around, touch up all the making goods, i.e. that, all these parts. I'll touch those in with the spray before I give it a full coat with spray. And as I'm going around, I will use these, all right? Now, these ones, I will use for my final coat, they don't bend. So what I basically do, you put it in the corner, you can see they're straight as hell. And you can just spray, spray it down, nice and perfect. Use one for one set of reveal, pull it down, let it dry. Because otherwise it's covered in paint. You could always wash it off, but I've got more than enough of these to go around and spray all the reveals in one house. So this would do one set of windows. Now these, this is the bollocks thing, because these, you get for free because you get them in the building side because they're the, the, they're the stair protectors. They sit in your staircase like that, they screw them down and it protects the edge of the actual tread so they don't get broken off. So they usually screw these down and what I do is like when I'm in the unit, if I see them laying around, I pick them up because they're perfect for the reveals, absolutely perfect. They are. So, should have organized this bit better. Now, you have uh, this spray shield, which is the metal spray shield. Now, just like with the trim coat one, it can be adjusted. No, sorry, the trim coat one can't be adjusted. It's just one angle. While as this, as you can see, it's got a little sort of fly nut there. You can adjust it to whatever angle you want. These are used for spraying doors. And I don't know if you've seen my other videos, what I do is, slide it underneath the door, spray, pull it out, spray, and you can usually spray maybe about 19 doors without cleaning it before it gets completely saturated with paint and you have to wash it off. So, in my point of view, you need these. As a sprayer, spray them on site to cut down with the overspray, you need these. Right, so I'm gonna show you the Trimco one in action right now. So I'm gonna leave that one. What I do is, give these, these reveals a light dusting. Not too heavy, and that way I can use these Trimco ones in two sets of reveals. Nice, quick, easy. There we go, so you can see the bend in it. Nothing fancy, he's just giving it a quick dust over. And the idea is, you want to get a coat in it, but look at that. It's protected the window, no overspray. That's the idea of this. So this is why it's good. You know, and as you can see, with a light dust, you're more likely, maybe I'll be able to get Another set of reveal out of this. I mean, as you can see, it's starting to get really saturated with paint. So it's getting to the point where, to tell the truth, no, it's too much paint in there. Now these ones, <coughs> I use when I find a coating because it's more accurate and I can lay the paint on a bit more thicker. 
an even deck. I'll still go over with a roller. Just to make sure. So, there you go.